a true connection with your pet Ellie Kane. This is an instructional video showing you how to use the Ellie Kane Smaller Bark Collar for small dogs. The most effective way to wean a dog from barking is to use an automatic collar against barking. The dog understands that whether the owner is nearby or not, barking is unacceptable. To start raising your dog, you should Number 1. Charge the collar Number 2. Adjust the belt Number 3. Set the sensitivity To charge the collar, use the cord that is included in the kit and any USB charger, power supply, power bank, laptop and others. At the bottom of the collar, open the protective stub. Insert the cable from the kit. While the collar is charging, the indicator is red. This means the collar isn't charged. When the collar is charged and ready to wear, the indicator turns green. Charging time. One and a half to two hours. The frequency of charging depends on the intensity of use. On average, you need to charge one time every one to two weeks. Don't forget to turn off the collar and close the protective stub at the bottom. This will protect your collar from dirt, moisture, and snow. First, turn on the collar. Press and hold the power button for three seconds. The collar should make a sound and the indicator should turn green. If the indicator is red, you should charge the collar before testing. Set the maximum sensitivity before testing the collar. To do that, press the plus until the collar stops making a sound. It will now be at the maximum level of sensitivity. Now blow on the sensor several times. The collar will initiate a bark response program. It consists of seven phases. The first reaction phase contains a short ultrasound warning signal. On the second phase, the sound becomes longer. In the third phase, vibration is connected to the sound which lengthens each bark, thus showing the dog that barking is not advisable. After phase 7, the collar falls asleep for one minute. If the time between the collar activations is more than 40 seconds, the collar starts the program from the first phase. Setting the sensitivity helps you configure the collar against the barking, specifically for your dog, adapting to its temba the power of voice and throat vibrations. By pressing the plus button, we make the collar more sensitive. The minus button makes the collar less sensitive. Sensitivity is not the power of sound or vibration. This is an adjustment to what the collar should respond to and what the collar should not respond to. The collar has seven phases of sensitivity. Phases one to four are for very loud dogs. Other sensitivity phases are for moderately loud and quiet dogs. We recommend starting the dog's training from the fourth level. To do this, press the minus button till the collar stops emitting a signal. Press the plus button three times. Now it is at the fourth phase. Each time you press the button, the collar makes a sound so you know the phase has switched. If the collar does not work when the dog is barking, it is necessary to increase the collar sensitivity. Continue to increase until the collar starts to work. If there are false alarms, it is necessary to gradually reduce the sensitivity while eliminating false alarms. A correctly adjusted strap is very important for the correct operation of the collar. The collar, Ellie Kane, has an adjustable belt that allows you to customize it exactly to the size of your dog. As a result, we should get a belt that will fit tightly on the dog and does not spin around its neck. To do this, gradually move the belt between the clips to the desired size. After the belt length is selected, we check the size on the dog. Put the collar on the dog and a finger should pass tightly in the space between the dog's throat and the collar. Great! Put the block in the center of the belt. The block can move along the belt. The excess belt must be cut. Treat the edges so it does not fall apart. Put a collar on the dog and check that the block is on the center of the dog's throat and that the clasp is on the opposite side. If necessary, correct. Now the collar is set up correctly. It takes a dog about 10 days to learn not to bark. Learning speed depends on the dog's temperament. If you still have any questions or something hasn't worked out, we will help you with pleasure. 
A true connection with your pet, Ellie Kane.